Hello my friends and welcome back to my channel. I'm just gonna go through some things that really annoy me right now because uh, the last video I posted was like a month ago that was like a proper video and then I tried to post something just so YouTube thinks that I'm posting regularly. I've been having technical issues with my equipment of making videos and also I've been quite busy so let me just go through that real quick right now. Okay, May was really like a little bit stressful and I've had a lot of schoolwork and I managed to do that and now I can finally say that I am free, I'm done with school now and honestly can't wait to start my classes next year honestly like I'm feeling good it was a bit stressful I need a break but like it's okay I'm good let's go through the things that are currently issuing me the next video that I was supposed to put out was a vlog from a trip that we went to we went to Italy and it was beautiful shots beautiful scenery honestly it was more like um in the beginning it was like a, a vlog but then I turned it into like a little documentary it's not really like it was really nice visually and I was really excited to go and edit that but I filled up my SD card on my camera so I took the videos which by the way there was 360 videos I put them on a separate USB key where I also keep all my past YouTube videos and a bunch of photos from my camera and I put the videos on there and then I deleted them from my SD camera because SD camera SD card because I didn't have space so one thing about SD cards, basically when you delete things, you can't really get them back. I mean, yes, there is programs that can get things back. I have worked with those a little bit annoying, <laughs> but not my point. I use that USB, if anyone cares, it's SanDisk, and I've been using those keys for some time. Have been a little bit of a problem already. They get really, like, really, really hot when, like, you transfer things. I've had problems, basically, some issues right but I thought okay it's fine it's fine I wanted to look at the photos on my TV so I plugged them in our Samsung TV guess what the photos didn't even show so that was a little bit weird to me so I was like okay put it back in my PC which is Windows um the key doesn't work it detects the key but there's no information on it you know the line that says how how full it is the line isn't even there and uh, that's a problem. I got two explanations from two different people. One said that smart TVs lock the things on your USB because of some copyright claims, some copyright issues, whatever. I was like, what? And then the second one was the USB port in your TV is like not okay and it damaged basically the the USB part that you plug in and this is why it can't read the files. So I was like, okay. Can I get them back? Probably not. That's the problem that I'm currently facing. There was 120 gigabytes of videos and photos on that that I kind of need to get back. And I talked to some professionals that work with those programs to get things back. They said it's 50 euros just to get it checked out. And I was like, you know what? I'll call back. Probably won't call back because that's too much money. And I'm gonna give them the money and they're gonna be like, well, actually, we can't fix it, sorry. Even if they do fix it, it's gonna cost me a, f a few hundred euros for sure. And I am i don't have that money, honestly. I bought a camera, I don't have the money. I heard of another person that does that, so I'm gonna go there and see if I can do something. I used Recuva, it's a program that gets back the files. Uh, it got them back, but I transferred them to another USB key and it doesn't play them. It's like damaged files can't play them for you like so basically useless didn't do anything So basically a bunch of problems with USBs and I need to get an um, how do you call that? It's like a, a disc like a, it's like a box that you have outside. It's like In terabytes like it's a it's a lot of space I need to buy that but I never really invested into those and now I think it's time because I cannot lose videos like I lost my SD card once and like now I lost this it's like when does it stop like I'm, I'm annoyed and I don't have the energy for this it's just really annoying what else my camera I need to call someone because it records now it's recording fine which is weird usually it records for like half a minute and then it's like movie recording stopped Slow card write speed. This isn't even 4K, like this is like Ultra HD, I think. It's like 25 frames per second, that's not a lot. And it shouldn't have problems, but the SD card is like 150 euros. And again, I'm not really rich at the moment. So um, we'll be working on 
solving that. That's what I kind of wanted to rant about, but I also have other videos that I'm kind of working on but they're too boring and i don't want to work on them because i'm bored so i don't know what's gonna come out first honestly i need to make a video talking about that usb problem because i've heard people on reddit saying like they had the same problem and then samsung support and all of those things so i need to put this out there at some point because honestly it's really really bad if you can't get them back so i don't know what videos you will see next from me hopefully i will come back as soon as possible and uh, have amazing summer i think i will definitely enjoy my breaks so bye